My name is Esteban Camacho Stephenson. So I'm beginning the YMCA mural. I'm going to be preparing the, the surface by abrading, which is basically sanding some of the smooth texture of the wall so that I can create many layers of paint. I'll start by just working on the background of an underwater cathedral environment. So that means I'm going to start with blues and light beams and eventually, but I will start blocking in big animals like a life-size whale, a two life-size whale, a lot of life-size animals. Some of those animals will actually be larger than life-size like the reef fishes and colorful animals. I'll have some human beings that are flowing with these schools or these groups of, of creatures to talk about working with community, but there will also be some human beings that are actively working to save a species or being, so that there's a little bit more of a call to action. But first you'll see the flow and then you'll see some of those hidden details. And not everything is really planned out because, I mean actually I've never planned out a project more. I've, I think I've been designing this since before January. And so it's been over six months of ideas and sketches and versions and I'll be trying to portray some other visual challenges like uh, refraction and reflection and lighting. five different ocean ecosystems, the Arctic, the temperate, the coastal, the tropical, and the open ocean. And again, I painted life-size animals of endangered species, and also the tropical and the temperate regions signified a little bit my heritage from Costa Rica and my heritage here in Oregon. So, then uh, that piece really springboarded me uh, as a 17 year old to then apply to an art school and pursue mural painting. And so now after almost 20 years, about 18 years, I have learned so much about art and conservation and community collaboration. And I'm trying to bring that same scope of creating an immersive mural but with all this new knowledge that I hope I have, will be able to express in this new mural. But we're almost, I'm also hoping to make a, an impact on people's lives. depicted are all of these animals swimming in these flowing lines and you know these whales are following the the tuna that are following the krill and the plankton and we are swimming along flowing with all these species and so it's you know showing our connection to, from the very beginning of when life first emerged and trying to show sort of the reverence how we belong to these ancient rhythms through these beams of light that are you know, creating this cathedral of underwater cathedral for all the swimmers at the Y. I'm gonna be continuing to paint at the lower sections, details, uh, and I'm looking forward to add a lot more of, a lot of hidden creatures and just continue to work on this painting as much as I can because I really feel connected to this project and want to make it as inspiring to the to its viewers so so for me the more beautiful and the, and the more work I put into it the more it will have an effect on people caring for the 
artwork.